Well, good morning. We uh, bought our house today. So let's go ahead and take a look at what trash heap we've gotten ourselves into. So. Second. Let's see. Our lovely kitchen here. Today is about throwing out trash and I guess keeping what might be worth keeping. It's all very exciting, I know. I'm gonna take a look down at the kids' bedrooms. Budweiser racing, all right. We don't have the power on yet, so it's a little hard to see, but there's a toilet and a shower set in there. One bedroom. Which closet. Okay. Two bedrooms. Joint bathroom with the next bedroom lacking toilet surprise it's a shithole <laughs> i don't think they're surprised at this point oh we've seen enough to know that oh okay <laughs> well, we get this awesome shoulder massager oh okay good we can keep that shoulder massager that's important this actually i might turn into a worm bin or something. Or mealworms, one of the two. And our outstanding living room. We've got a mouse and a, and a, a yuck puddle. Oh, thank God we got a mouse. Oh, go, go get a close up of the hey, yuck puddle. At least we got, the hey, at least we got one of the mice, okay? That's the important thing. And then whatever that yuck puddle. There's. <laughs> oh, I just hope my sauerkraut doesn't look like that back at home. Right. Future skylight? <laughs> yeah, we're working on a skylight. It's a natural skylight in that nature formed the skylight. Excellent. Yeah. Excellent. It's a little big, don't you think? Um, nah. I think it'll just, <laughs> as it grows, it'll become even better <laughs> and bigger. Well, that's, uh, it's really the grand tour of the And the house. insulation's coming out naturally in the summertime so that we can relieve more of that heat out of the house. Mm -hmm. You know, heat rises. I see. That stuff's just getting in the way. So, yeah. Let's head back on out. We can take a look at the overall property. What? Everyone has an Easter egg hunt. Oh, I know. Oh, that oh, it's covered in mouse piss. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know what you expected. Uh, I honestly just kind of expect that of all the I'm surfaces. I'm excited for Easter, honestly. Well, that's look. in a week. Look, there's a little Easter egg. Okay. Hey, um, I'll come show you some pretty flowers. Okay. So this is not a terrible video. Where? Are there more than just the one set of pretty flowers? You know, this is going to be a lot like our other video, except the other video actually looked like a living room place. <laughs> well, we, uh, we, we paid a lot more for that place, though, so that's the, that's the, the optimistic thing to remember here. You know, I'm actually not sure I'll have to look it up. Those guys are? I think they are. Oh, those are pretty, though. Yeah, they're pretty cool. Yeah. Or no, they're, um... I don't have that. Oh, uh, I grew them for a science project one time. Oh, well. I thought you learned from that. Oh, there's some more daffodils over there. Yeah. We got a couple patches of those. I think a lot of these are just coming so, up, too, so... There's what would be our front gate if we had one, you know? Eventually we'll have to, so I can fence this area off, but we'll get there. This is gonna be our future garden site. Yeah, garden will be here. The trees aren't the best part about the garden, but that's all right. It'll help cut down on this wind because all this is cornfield around us, so there's not really any wind blockage. Flowers. Yeah. Well, we'll get those. Oh, I need to take a trench. Oh, there's going to be roots everywhere. Yeah. 
Well, we don't need to dig a trench on this side. It's already okay. So, well, shall we go look at the barn? Yeah. Inside. Well, we might as well walk around the rest of the way. I believe they're still alive. Okay. All right. Let's keep going this way. So you can see, there is a fence here that I might just need to reinforce. It's probably salvageable. Um, I think I just need some, yeah, some posts to reinforce it. But I mean, we've got grass growing all around here, so that'll be good. We'll be able to run chickens through very, you know. Uh, that's our neighbor's cornfields. They rent those out, I guess. We're hoping we might be able to pick up a little bit of it maybe next year or so. We'll, we'll just have to see how they feel about it. I have no clue what the purpose of this fence is. <laughs> it's they just, won't even get out of the car. Well, that's fine. They're like two boo-boos right in a picnic basket. How often do they get to drive the car? You know, they're excited about that. And here's our barn, which I know you saw briefly at the beginning of this video. Oh, come on. What are you, what are you doing? Start them off. All right. So we're going to go in and see the barn. Not... Go inside. Yeah, but that's like a, that's a support vine right there. Oh, that was a structure. <laughs> Okay. Yeah, there's, you know, a little water damage. <laughs> Another future skylight. Another skylight. Oh, I know. All over here. Yeah, I know. Oh, it's over here too. Yeah, it's not great. Oh, but anyway, you can see we got some water leakage through the roof over here, and then it kind of seeps in the floors over here. But we're going to throw some pallets down so we can at least get our stuff out of storage while we work on everything else. Uh, harpsichord. Eh? Eh? We might keep that. It'd be... It's, it comes with these sweet cobwebs. That is the proper way to decorate your harpsichord, by the way. Yeah, I'd say so. Uh, deep freeze that I wouldn't trust, but we can use it for uh, livestock feed. Oh, don't open that. Once we... I, mean, I made the mistake of opening it. <laughs> don't, don't go up there either. It's not safe. I, that was just, I wasn't going to go up there. I'm going to go up the stairs. The stairs are sturdy. I've checked them already before. What is this thing? Um, That's where I told you. Almost heaven, animal, animal haven. Two. Two. See, we got a, uh, I know it's dark up here. Hey, there's a teeter-totter up here. Kids will lose their minds. Yeah, they'll also lose their footing and fall right through the ceiling. I wasn't planning on leaving the teeter-totter yeah. up here. That's such a weird name because it just implies that the animals are dying. Animal haven. <laughs> the I'm almost really, heaven. I'm really concerned that she was, like, doing monkey genocide or something. I don't think she was doing monkey genocide. Monkey that genocide. would what? Okay, there's, an right here. there's a busted ass circular saw. It's a little, it's a little cool in here right now. Let's pop up the thermostat. <laughs> Get that going. Yeah, nice, nice mm -hmm. warm, six, seventy-six degrees. But anyway, so this is what we got to work with. Got ducting in here, because yeah. if we haven't already told you, this place used to be a monkey rescue. Well, at least we don't need to get ducks. We can keep these and get chickens. I think uh, that's about it. We've, we've done the grand tour of the place at this point. So. You know, I'm well. gonna go in the crawl space <laughs> now and hate myself. Yeah. And my decisions. Mm -hmm. Well, there we are. We own it though. Yep. <laughs> All right.